Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at an example illustrating how to calculate the angle between two diagonals of a cube. The, uh, assume that the side of the cube is of length 1. So, we want to find the angle between diagonals on the faces of this cube. So, assume this is y-axis, this is x-axis and this is z-axis. So, the cube will look like something like this. So, the vector A is this one and vector B is this one. This is vector B, this is vector A. So, the coordinates are, so the coordinates of vector A or the vector A is also can be defined as 1 into x hat plus 0 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. This is because uh, the value, uh, the vector A is on the uh, x z plane. That means, the, uh, the y component is 0 and the x and z components are exactly 1, exactly equal to 1. Similarly, the vector b can also be defined, can be defined as 0 into x hat plus 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. Clearly, it is on the y z plane, therefore, the x component is 0 and the uh, z, y and z components are equal to 1 each. So, this is the vector a and this is vector b. Our goal is to find the angle theta between vector a and b. In order to solve for theta, we can use the dot product formula. That is a dot b is equal to modulus or amplitude of a dot b is equal to magnitude magnitude of a into magnitude of b into cos theta. So, a dot b is equal to 1 into x hat plus 0 into 1 into x hat plus 0 into y hat can be ignored and then we have 1 into z hat and b is equal to 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. So, we have x hat dot y hat is 0 and next we have x hat with dot product with z hat is 0. So, only thing left is z hat dot product with z hat which is 1. Therefore, a dot b is 1 and modulus of a is clearly equal to 1 plus 1 2 that is square root of 2 and similarly modulus of b is equal to 1 plus 1 2 that is square root of 2. Therefore, cos theta from this equation 1 is a dot b divided by the product of modulus of a into modulus of b, which is equal to 1 by square root of 2 into square root of 2, which is 1 by 2. So, for this instance of the cube or for this cube uh, with the, one of the faces on the x z plane and the other face on the x uh, y z plane, theta between the diagonals on the corresponding faces is clearly equal to cos inverse of 1 by 2 which is equal to 60 degrees. Similarly, the angle between this uh, diag uh, the, the diagonal on this face and also the diagonal on this face that is on the x y plane is also equal to 60 degrees. That is, that is for this cube, for the same cube, the angles between this diagonal and this diagonal that is from origin to this point that is B, uh, the vector B and vector A that is origin to this point and the, uh, this diagonal that is origin to the other corner on the x, y plane, the angle between these diagonals, each of the angles that is equal to alpha equal to 60 degrees.